Okay, my name is uh, Susan Davis and uh, I'm originally from England in the UK and I arrived in Jakarta on the 15th of August 2001. Okay, uh, so what was the cultural shock have you ever felt when you came to Indonesia? My biggest shock was shopping. Oh, for shopping? Yes, because um, I'll tell you my little story. Okay. When I uh, first went to the supermarket, which was the day after we arrived, and um, we went to Alpha Mart and I got my trolley because we didn't have any food at all, only the very basics. And I walked into the supermarket and I thought, mmm, what's that smell? Yeah. And I started to walk around and I thought, oh, it smells even worse. Everything must be bad. It must be gone off in here. And it wasn't until I actually left the supermarket and I didn't have anything in my trolley, oh. some sugar and tea bags and that was it. And a couple of days later, somebody said, well, you seem to be eating out all the time. And we said, well, yeah, because all the food in the supermarket is bad. And they said, oh, no, it's not. It's durian season. So and that was sort of a shock. Okay. Um, yeah. Uh, so uh, did you integrate or combine the new culture with your own beliefs? Um, yes. Yes, of course. Yeah. It takes time. It's exciting. Obviously, you, you sort of each new thing that you encounter you sort of question and you look at it and you think, mm, do I really understand that? Or, you know, do I understand what's going on here? But I think as you learn, as you sort of move through the culture or stay with the culture, then you start to um, become more flexible in the ways that you do things. And then I think you sort of, uh, you can do things in the same way to a certain extent. So with understanding, um, comes the ability to uh, understand what's going on around you and maybe reacting in, in slightly different ways. Uh, By the time you uh, finally accept the cultural shock? Uh, finally, I think what helped me was working at LSPR um, and I think understanding communication and culture, yeah. which uh, was a subject that initially I was teaching here. Yep. Uh, and I think that really helped me understand what was going on around me. So I would probably say, probably within a couple of years of actually being here. Uh, so at the end, uh, have you ever felt homesick? Um, I think it's slightly different for me because I haven't lived in the UK permanently since 1998. So I was away for three years before I actually came to Indonesia. So I think feeling homesick Yes, I do. I still do now slightly. It's nice to go home. But when I'm home, I think of it as more like in the UK as being more I'm going on holiday to see my family. And when I come back to Indonesia, I feel more that I'm coming home nowadays. Okay. And I'll usually say I'm going home to Jakarta. Mm -hmm. I'm going to UK to see my family.